going to be a long day. Why? Because of you. That's why. <laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome to the Dickie Dine Show. Today we are going to be doing a video. <laughs> We're going to kill ourselves. We're finally going to do it. I went to Twitter and I asked you guys what are some weird things that you guys do that are strange or odd or weird or peculiar in any <laughs> shape. What are some weird things that are weird guys? <laughs> Oh no. You have a hair. I am hair. <laughs> anyway, let's go over some things that are strange and peculiar. 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 Park Parkinson's. Arthas does... Arthas? Arthas. <laughs> okay. Doing death metal growling at my cat while others are around. She enjoys it. Does she enjoy it or does she just like put up with it? I don't think you can like really <laughs> tell that a cat is enjoying something. Like that can, the cat likes it. Like no, the cat wants to murder you in your sleep. <laughs> do, you, do you cats actually do that? I feel like cats like put up with so much shit. Well yeah, because you feed them. It's just they're so like emotionless. You never know if they're upset or happy or whatever. But I mean. You want to hear a fun fact about cats? Yeah. Did you know that cats check your breathing while you're sleeping to make sure you're alive? Yeah. And, and if you're not alive, they start eating you? I heard that. Yeah. Well, the viewers might not have. Thomas666, sticking a finger in my bum whilst wanking. So, I mean, <laughs> I think people do that. It's weird that you told us that. But <laughs> <laughs> I think people do that, like, in secret. <laughs> Can you think of anything else to tell us? All right, if Frank Arena eats kiwi skin. Dude, yeah, I you're do. a fucking monster. What? I've done that. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> I've done that. What are you, dude, you guys are fucking weird. Okay, <laughs> that is so st fucking. Justin does that. My guitarist fucking does that. He came. Someone was like, "Do you know Justin eats the skins of the kiwis?" And I was like, "No, he fucking doesn't. People don't do that." And he came around the corner and he's holding a kiwi that had been bitten. And I was like, <laughs> "Fucking kill yourself, dude. Who does that?" I. You're, I, a, you're a monster. I haven't had a kiwi in like five years, but good, I good. used to do that. Why? For sure. They're I don't know. It's just weird. It's like the way it's the way that like the liquid wraps around the the fuzz, and it's just like a it's a texture. It's, it's like a it's like a, a satisfying texture once it like gets wet and it like it's kind of squishy. It's like soft. I don't know. It's nice. You try. You want to eat my testicle later? It's about the same effect. It's like it's like it's like, it's like a hairy outside. It's got a little skin and squishy on the inside. And yeah, you just described my fucking nut. I'm gonna eat that. <laughs> um, Pat slash Rick says texting grandparents. Okay, that is a little strange. That's a little different. I never text my grandparents. I do. I I wish I could text my grandparents. Yeah. Well, mainly one because my grandpa's dead. <laughs> so that'd be cool if I could text him because I'd be like, Yo, what's the afterlife like? And then the other one is because like, like phone calls are cool, but I hate phone calls with my grandma because it's a volume issue. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, Hey, grandma, what are you up to? And she's just like. <laughs> <laughs> <He was just like, laughs> what? I don't know. She, my grandma's a monkey or something. I don't know. But you know, I think it'd be cool if because I've been trying to get her to fucking understand texting for so long because it'd be so much better to be like because I want to check in on my grandparents because yeah. like you know they're they're expiring. <laughs> so I want to be like, yo, I hope you don't die soon. And like, how's it going? How's your your weird dish of candies that are only yeah. like mints? Your really expensive like dishes that no one can touch. Yeah, How the are China. Those doing? How's that doing? <laughs> Uh, and so it'd be cool to text him. So yeah. I, I, if I could, yeah, I would do that too. <laughs> so it's not that weird. I guess it's it's unordinary because yeah. nobody really does that. Right. Losing, losing circulation. <laughs> oh god! Oh, I pushed them all together. Oh god! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be an issue for me. <laughs> Life is an issue. Yeah. All right. Totally not six mix twelve says masturbating in public. Well, like, I don't know if that. How? Like, what do you mean, though? Like, you just like are in the middle of the street and you're just like, <laughs> like or, as cars or, are coming yeah. by. Or is it like, like secret? Like, like you're, I don't know, I don't, what's a secret? Like, if you're like, you're in like, like in a bathroom or something. Like, yeah. you go to like a public bathroom and you just like get off because you're like, oh, there's people around me. Yeah. Or are you literally just like in the subway, just like, <laughs> just like I'm just gonna shoot, him, like like, like sticking up like yeah, jewelry just, stores, just, like I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna shoot. Or just have a gun to people and like, don't move. <laughs> Don't fucking move. Like, are you gonna rape us? Like, no, just, I'm just gonna jack off to you for a bit. Just don't move. Just let me do my thing. And you can go about your day. Oh, God. Cam says, I eat my grilled cheese with ketchup and my Oreos with salsa. The Oreos uh, with salsa is a little strange. Even the grilled cheese with ketchup is like, 
Well, that one is like, I could see somebody doing that, but it's weird, but like... Well, I used to eat grilled cheese with tomato soup all the time. Well, yeah, that's a normal thing. And it's like kind of similar. It's not the same. It's well, similar, it's, though. It's just because they're both tomatoes, it's, it's the same. It's not the same. It's like eating french fries with sour cream because you do it on potatoes. It's not the same. It's weird. <laughs> it, okay. That's a good analogy. It's I different. I fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the, my problem, though, is that like, we've been tame about the ketchup. You do what with Oreos? <laughs> eat them with salsa, like, together? Or you're just like, I have a plate of Oreos, I have a plate of salsa, I'm gonna eat these, and I'm gonna eat these, or you take the Oreos I'm and dip them in the salsa. Imagine he's dipping them in Yeah, it's like his milk. Why? It's like salsa milk. Just... What? Situation where you in where that first came about. Maybe you, he's from like Mexico. You just had a tray of Oreos and you were in a fucking Mexican restaurant. You're like, oh no, my Oreos and the salsa, <laughs> and you're like, oh, these aren't half bad. I'm gonna do this from now on. It's like my strange addiction. Yeah, it is like I'm addicted to, to dipping Oreos in my salsa. It's like how fucking like Reese's and how Reese's, Reese's came Reese's about. Peanut butter. There's like and, peanut yeah. butter and chocolate, and somebody spilled them or whatever. And yeah. Salsa and Oreos. <laughs> you like soggy cereal? <laughs> what? Wait, it's dill. At, at hey it's dill likes soggy cereal. <laughs> what kind of person are who, who are you people? Salsa and Oreos, soggy cereal, eating the outside of a kiwi. Why don't you eat food like a normal fucking person? Soggy cereal. That's like that defeats the entire purpose of cereal. It's like a you're just eating goop. Why not just eat pudding if you want soggy stuff? Why are you eating soggy? You, that's a process too. You have to pour the cereal, leave it out for a bit to get soggy, and come back and then just like slurp fucking mush. Who the, why? Why do you do that? Just eat a different fucking item. Eat some, eat oatmeal. That's a soggy cereal basically. Why not just do that? What the fuck is wrong with you? God damn it, dude. You okay? I'm okay. I'm okay. Right. Rutabaga Big Ears says, I pretend to be a fennec fox with lots of other people who pretend to be animals on the internet. So you're a furry. Yeah. Why don't you just call it that? Yeah. Why don't you just trying to like justify it? Like, it's a fennec it, yeah. fox. No, I, it's not a weird thing. It's okay. not a furry, it's just, a fennec it's fox. It's like, you know how people dress up on Halloween? Like I dress up like an animal. <laughs> and I, I might fuck someone yeah, else. I, maybe I pull out my dick a little bit. Who and then, is also an might animal, be wearing an animal. Like, just cause when Sonic the Hedgehog comes on, I get aroused. <laughs> doesn't mean I'm weird, okay? You're the weird one for not wanting to fuck people in animal costumes. I don't want to fuck animals. I just want to fuck As people the, in the, animal the, costumes. Yeah, it's the costumes that yeah, it's the, I just the, the the fur friction is what gets me. It's, it's See, that's like, why I eat kiwis with the skin. Oh, like, oh, like, you're a furry in your free time. Did you, did you post this in hopes to segue me into furrying with you? Is that what this is? It's called fennec fox. <laughs> I think that's just a type of animal. I think that's his favorite. I don't think that's what it's called. I think it's this is my... Animal of choice is a fennec fox. Get it right. <laughs> Learn my pronoun. <laughs> <laughs> Acknowledge the fox kin. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> uh, Nick Wilson says, I have on numerous occasions drank a whole pot of coffee and then gone to sleep. Well, I, I get that. If you I can mean, do that, that's not that weird. No, well, I get it. It's well, just it's like, like I, I think energy just does that to most people. It's like you usually get tired as soon as you drink it, and yeah. then if you stay up past it, that's when you get your energy burst. Right. I think that's just how caffeine works. So yeah. it doesn't really make sense. Or it makes sense. Like I do, I do that all the time. Like I'll be like one in the morning, I'll drink like a rock star or something, and then mm -hmm. go to sleep afterwards. It's like as long as I don't stay up I past just, that point, then I I'll imagine be him like sitting there with his coffee, just drinks it, and then like knocks himself <laughs> yeah, out. Yeah. It's like and falls like, the asleep second he finishes it, just like. I don't think it's like the, the 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 thing where you fall asleep standing up, whatever oh, that's yeah. called. Narcolepsy. Narcolepsy. Like he just like gets narcoleptic <laughs> halfway through, and just <laughs> falls asleep every time. Just getting a head rush from all the fucking caffeine and just passes out. Like, yeah, right. <laughs> I get blue balls like all the time. What? <laughs> How? You know, get just like balls. walking around getting blue balls. I was gonna say, or... don't you get blue balls from like intense like. Arousal that just never is fulfilled. So yeah. you're like you're all the time just like God, I want to fuck something. Right? All the time, just like looking at a wall, and you're just like, Oh, I could put my dick in that. And just like, Ooh, just all the fucking time. Just go to Arby's and they're like, Oh, do you want roast beef? And you're just like, Oh, roast beef looks like pussy, dude. You're just like, I want to fuck it. It's constant blue ball. <laughs> Some people get off on different things. <laughs> or I guess not get off because you get blue balls. <laughs> Why not just, 
Maybe you should jerk off more. Maybe that's your. <laughs> maybe you should not jerk off enough. If you, I, I can get you laid if you put on a fox costume. That other guy will fuck you. <laughs> so, right. There's that. Oh fuck. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching that video. If you like to hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. Ooh, you will, bro. Ooh, you will. Ooh, you will, Kuji. And let us know what you'd like to see in future videos, and we yeah. just might ignore you. Come on down to my website. I have I have started a domain website for weird fetishes. Yeah. Yeah. Can you guess the, the name? No. It's called daddydom.com. <laughs> <laughs> no, it should be called dickydom.com. Dicky Dom? I like that. Yeah, we can do Dicky Dom. It's, like, Dom. it's like a dating service website, like Christian Mingle, but for like people with really weird fetishes. Yeah. So like they come there and they're like, oh, I want to, I don't want to fuck kids, but I want to fuck people, like adults that dress up like kids. So you know, like, <laughs> oh yeah, we got you. Yeah. <laughs> it's like that. So like, Dom. <clears throat> yeah. So if you want to, I have a Kickstarter set up to fund <laughs> my, my domination Dude, site. you've had like 12 Kickstarters. Nobody funds my products. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing it till I get it. That, fucking that one guy got thirty thousand dollars for making egg salad. Okay, I'm gonna get a Kickstarter for. No, my dude, it was like almost sixty thousand. Well, that's even fucking more of a reason to, to fund my domination <laughs> website. So yeah, if you have a weird fetish, donate money to me, and I'll get you a partner to like Dom or whatever. Or Dicky. Yeah, or Dicky, Dicky. Yeah. You want to put on a diaper and get fucked in your soiled diaper? <laughs> Come on to my dom site. Have you met my my girlfriend Deborah? <laughs> no, I have not. I made her of string and your hair. I don't think you made her. I made her. Did I'm, you? I'm an exquisite artist. Did you make her, then take it to Hot Topic, and then put it in a bag so I could buy it later? Yes, I have distributed my girlfriend via Hot Topic. <laughs> I run an adult service <laughs> via Hot Topic. An adult string making yes. girlfriend service? It's more of a metaphor than anything. A metaphor for it's what? It's like well, the actual girl. So it's like you get this, and it's like, okay, so this is like a key, and you can go to Hot Topic After Hours and give them this little token, and then they'll give you an actual fuck slave or whatever. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I didn't, yeah. I didn't realize Hot Topic was involved in that kind of thing. Well, I don't think they know what's going on. It's just they use the store. <laughs> like, I distribute these to them, and then they sell them because they're like, oh, these are cool little trinkets. And then I go to the store after hours, and then I solicit human trafficking. <laughs> And so you bought one. So this got really dark. So really around, quick. around midnight, we can go to Hot Topic and you can claim your princess. <laughs> you heard it here first, folks. Go claim your princess at Hot Topic. Jared and Austin sent you. Tell them we sent you. <laughs> so that could be a strange thing that Austin does yeah. in his spare time. I, I run a human trafficking center through Hot Topic. That's, that's, <laughs> what, that's what I do in my free time. All right.